What's up, Montreal? How you doing? I'm from America. I'm very sensitive right now. We're going through a hard time. <laughs> yeah. Uh, how do I explain? Things are so bad in America right now that when Donald Trump does horrible things, the news has to relate them to other horrible things he's done to make you understand how horrible they are. Do you understand what I'm saying? Like, they're like, they do things like, to make you understand the horrible thing he did today, here's the other horrible thing you missed. Oh, my God. Is that really a thing? It's like the reverse of shopping at Amazon.com. <laughs> Did you hate what Donald Trump said about immigrants? Then you'll really hate what he said about transgender people. Oh, I will. I will. I think the moment that really swung it for me recently with, with uh, President Trump was when he said, he did an interview where he actually said the words, being the president is harder than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> ah, not as hard as it is to watch you be the president. Uh, <laughs> I'm sure it's harder to be the president. I'm sure every president who's ever existed has had that moment. Like, this is harder than I thought. But the job is literally about not saying it out loud. <laughs> I'm sure the moment you take the oath of office, yes, I promise and I swear, and they take you back into the actual White House and show you the real things that America is doing throughout history and all over the planet, you're like, oh my God. And then you have to go back and, hey, ha ha, it's gonna be good, maga. <laughs> And then the other thing, it's just the one good thing about Trump, I gotta be honest, is that he's completely blunting the myth of white supremacy, and I gotta thank him for that. <laughs> here's, here's my proof. He appointed a guy to be the attorney general, the lead lawyer in the country named Jeff Sessions. Jeff Sessions was found to be too racist to be a judge in Alabama! There's still black people walking around Alabama like, are we free? I think we're free. I, <laughs> I feel like I heard something. I feel like I heard something. And it's just crazy, because, you know, I got, I got, I'm like living this life. I got two daughters I got to bring up, you know, in this world, trying to explain it to them. I got two daughters. We only make girls. That's how we do it. That's how we really make America great again, just a generation of all ladies. <laughs> yes, I knew you'd like that, yeah. And my daughters are mixed race, because my wife is white. It's not her fault, it's how she was raised. <laughs> I don't blame her, it's just how she came up. So I have these mixed race kids, and it's the funny thing, I think a lot about things about race and racism, but the minute I have these daughters, my whole perspective changed on race. The moment my first daughter, Sammy, was born, she came out and she was bright white. Yeah, like so bright white, my brother-in-law was like, what happened? <laughs> they gave you the wrong baby. So my daughter came out bright white, and the weird thing is, is like she's gotten a little bit darker as she gets older, and so now I don't know where her color's gonna settle, but I'm having fun charting her color progress <laughs> by using the cover of Michael Jackson albums <laughs> in reverse chronological order. <laughs> Started out dangerous, then it was bad, maybe we'll make off the wall, it never be thrilling, you know what I mean? And so, but now when I walk, when she was a baby, I'd walk around the world with my daughter Sammy and I'd walk around with her in the world and she was like this little white head baby with a black dad and people were freaked out. They didn't understand how it worked. And that's, and, you know, they would get all like, what's happening? And that's why I'm glad I'm a comedian because I would just use it to screw with people. <laughs> so you gotta laugh sometimes. One time I was walking down the street, little Sammy bobbling head, I'm my chest, walking a little, people see this black guy and this white head baby, they look back and forth and I look at all those people Looked down at my beautiful daughter, looked up those people, and I took off running. <laughs> and they're like, that black guy stole that white baby! Thank you, good night, everybody. Thank you, Montreal.